watch these three displays. Stan Jibalisco here. Watch these three things right here. Canine X-Ray Delta is running a frequency radio teletype contest. Watch how these displays work. XY scope, two ellipses perpendicular to each other. Spectrum. Spectrum, two pips line right up with those yellow lines. Waterfall display, the brightest lines coincide with these vertical yellow lines. He keeps asking for the number. Evidently these people aren't familiar with this contest. Neither am I, actually. I'm just trying to show you how to tune. How to tune using this MMTTY version 1.66G W1GV here. K9 X-Ray Delta calling CQ. When, it, when you first get the program, hit View. Hit XY Scope, make sure. Make sure that XY Scope is checked. XY Scope size. Make it big. Set your mark signal at around 2125 hertz. The program will compensate for slight errors. W2NRA is trying to get him. Well, what I'm trying to get at here, <clears throat> trying to let him come in between my yammerings. There's some other signals now pretty close to the same frequency, but these are all the defaults pretty much except for the background. K9XD is running a frequency. He had a little trouble getting W2NRA, but they finally hooked up. All these other settings here. Note all these other settings. Um, again, this program will compensate for slight tuning errors and automatic frequency control will help
I believe it's ATC, Automatic Tuning Control. I think you want to hit that so that it looks like it's protruding. That little button right there. You've got to play around with this program a little bit, but tuning radio teletype signals is kind of a fine art. But um, remember, your, your XY scope is a real good way to do that. And again, you have to hit view. It's not normally enabled. Make sure that box is checked. Make sure it's big. I don't know what the heck that is. I, I really haven't played that much with this program other than to... You've got to set the right COM port, too, and I'm not sure exactly how to do that. Set up MMTTY. You gotta, well, you gotta hit the right port, and each computer is a little different. If you have, if you can't make your interface work the first time around, just keep clicking on everything in sight. Remember, that is my paradigm. Just so you don't get all all upset here, I didn't transmit. That's just the tone that came in the computer. This computer can't even transmit on the radio. It's not even hooked up to transmit on the radio. But I'm just trying to give you a little hint as to how to tune this stuff in. Set the shift at 170, that's the most common. Bandwidth, I believe, 50 hertz, 60 hertz will also work. 70 is the default that the program came down with. A lot of these other macros and things, I don't use any of that stuff. I do it all manually, basically. You can change the window size if you want. Kill it all together and look at great images in NASA wallpaper. Bring it back. Move it around. Kind of has a default size. Uh, when it first comes up on your screen. Well, that ought to just about be enough of that. Stan Gibalisco here, prime elder of the magnates of malarkey. You can get to my website, like webmarks. This is my uh, Google Chrome program. My author's guild website, Stan Gibalisco, prime elder of the magnates of malarkey, fearless leader of the barons of baloney and in general the supreme intergalactic commander of the sultans of stupidity my website there and all sorts of good juicy stuff for you including a link to all my videos youtube channel there you go greetings from the black hills of south dakota united states yeah but you already knew that well, I hope you've borne with me this long um, so that I could show you a little bit about this radio teletype program called MMTTY. You have three tuning indicators, a spectrum, a waterfall, and an XY scope. Normally, when you first install the program, the XY scope is not enabled. In order to enable it, you have to hit view, check that box, and then... Make sure that your XY scope is big, nice and big. Then you can set all your fonts. The option menu basically will tell you all that stuff. 
all this stuff here, a lot of this AGC, that's uh, limiting. Mark, you can set all these things, set the shift. A lot of these things, I don't even know what they are, to tell you the truth. I just let them set to the default. You want 45.45 for Bordeaux code. And this should all come to the default with the default. Transmit port. There you go. There's your port. Now you got to set your port to the right one. And my other computer that where the radio is connected has eight ports. And I need to set it up for COM4. COM4. Now this one I don't care because I'm not going to try and transmit using this program on this computer. This is a Windows 8 computer. It seems to run all right. Windows 7 is on the computer that I use with the radio. So that's a little bit of instructional ditties on uh, MMTTY, but again, really seriously, my... Uh, my uh, <laughs> Play around with everything in sight. And I suppose I could add this. Until next time, so long.